Hey YouTube, how's it going? MacMan here, and today I got a new application for you guys. Um, I used to have this on my PC, um, but what it is, is it's like Photoshop, but it's absolutely free and legal, safe. Um, it's called GIMP. I have it right here. Um, I will be putting the download link in the description, um, but as soon as you download it, it's really easy. You just have to click the download button, um, and then once you download it, you will it will appear in your downloads right here so I'm gonna open that up you'll have um, this drive on the on your desktop and then you'll have this um, open up important notes make sure you read this um, if it's not working for you um, and then once you um, finish all that you need this thing called X11 um, but anyways once you finish that you'll have drag you must must drag GIMP into your applications folder Okay, and then once you drag your in into your applications folder, um, you can eject this. Or else, every time you open up GIMP, that thing will keep popping up on your screen. And you go into applications, uh, I don't have an icon on it right now. Um, but it will load after. Um, so yeah, I'm going to open it up. It takes a bit of time to open up. See, it just opened up this X11 thing. Sorry, just taking a sip of my hot chocolate because it is cold outside, but warm inside. I don't know. So um, you have this screen. It's not going to look like this for you, um, but I can show you how to change it to make it look black after. Um, I'll make the next video coming out soon. Um, so yeah, basically it's like Photoshop. Like look, it's it's basically identical. Um, you hit File, New Project, uh, change the size to whatever you like. Um, and then you can just get crazy, get funky, get loud. Um, so, yeah, it's 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 great. It's I had Photoshop earlier, um, and this is a lot like it. So, uh, you can do pretty much the same stuff. Um, you can look at some YouTube tutorials on how to find some cool things. Like I could um, let's see if I remember how to do this filter render. There's a neon setting where I can like make it look the text look neon you can blur um, I'll see if I can find it quickly um, oh yeah and I want to put a question in the video Christmas is coming up um, so what do you guys want for Christmas uh, just leave a comment in the comment section below whatever I'm just gonna blur it and see you can just blur it so yeah it's, it's really cool um, yeah, so I, I, I suggest downloading it if uh, you want Photoshop, but there's no way of getting Photoshop because it's so blocked up and everything, so I just download this. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Uh, if you want some tutorials on how to do some stuff or download brushes, let me know. Um, this is MacMan. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you next time. Peace.